Most of us are dreaming about hitting it big in the mega millions. The jackpot has swelled to over a half a billion dollars. And if you're lucky enough to hit, you know you're going to want to. But lottery officials say take a deep breath and sign that ticket. And some of you may be tempted to, but don't post it on Facebook. Instead, put the signed ticket in a safe place until you contact state lottery officials. Now, lottery pools are popping up in workplaces everywhere, but make sure you're not jumping into a shark tank, so know the company you keep. I would never, you know, take the money and run. That's not me. Lawyers specializing in lottery disputes suggest drafting something like a prenup with the others in the lottery pool. It should be done a certain specific way with identified members of the pool, with identified rules, and a, a game plan of what would happen if you should win. And make it clear what happens if someone skips a week because they're sick or on vacation. She comes around and she has everybody who puts her money in. However, I do have to say I was on holiday about it a month ago and she covered me. I forgot to put my money in. And she covered me while I was gone. Because you hear the horror flicks that they didn't get in, and so yeah. nobody put them in, so all of a sudden they come back for vacation and they don't get no money to put in. <laughs> right, right. I put the people she in did, to go on vacation. Cover. Kimberly Craig, 7 Action News.